And now to some Christmas stories. Families, especially mothers and their children, stormed the parks for early boarding to the destinations for the Yuletide. However, they have been complaining of the high cost of transport. Now, transporters are saying the increase is as a result of several factors, ranging from increase in fuel costs to bad roads. Other factors are maintenance, uh, levies, uh, extortion by security personnel, among others. Our correspondent Justine Tabuku was at Jibo Lagos to fuel the poor of the people, her report. Jibowu is majorly a commercial area with so many transport businesses. It's a popular interchange in Lagos. In the spirit of Utah season, Plus TV Africa visited the scene, and as usual, transporters were loading their buses. The transport workers didn't seem satisfied with their turnover so far. They complained of low turnout of travelers compared to last year. We used to load much luxuriouses, but this time, due to the financial um, instability of the country, Things aren't going up well. Passengers aren't coming up again because of no money to travel. It's not much like people that travel last year. Like last year, people go through everywhere here. But this year, it's very people are just managing to travel. The turnout of people these days are few because there's no money for people to travel. People are coming, they are complaining, it's too high. 20, 15, 18k is too high. Travelers too, we are not finding it easy. They complained of outrageous costs of transport. They blamed the act on the grid of the transport operators, saying it has been an old practice by transport industry operators. Some said it's due to state of economy, poor governance and policies. Since Christmas time, once in a year that we get to meet our family, people that we've not seen for a long time, we get to see them this time. But the transport is really high because from Lagos to get now today is 19,500. They still have to pay for your luggage, Joe. Oh, it's not easy. As of last year, I think it's very, very cheaper than nowadays. As of last year, we were traveling with, that was 12,005, but here now, almost 17,000 something. So we don't have a um, monetary system, we don't have price control and all that. As a result, the price must surely not be the same, rather it will go up. They also shared some of the expectations come 2022. Well, my expectation is that I advise the government and people in charge, let them consider the, the average Nigerians that is suffering. Let them have fixed price. Not this one charge 20, this one 21, this one 15, this one like this. It's not good. Let them help as in the design of this country. Maybe like let them as in the form of like maybe creating job awareness for things like that for the youth. The travelers also disclosed that they are disturbed about the rising insecurity on the roads. For many of them, being with their loved ones at Christmas is worth all the sacrifice and travel risk. Jacinta Ubiuku for Plus TV Africa. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.